Good day, watchers. When I started to get into watches about three years ago, I used to wear very large watches like the Casio G-Shocks. So I kind of got into this stage of just getting small watches. And so I got this watch. This is a mini turtle watch. I am still shying away from the full size of the turtle back then. Now it is actually one of the many watches that I have in my collection. I have been actually made a video of this one, so here it is. By the way, please follow and support my channel. Just one click on the subscribe button below. Over the years, Seiko has launched many different with dive watches in many different styles. Some of these have come to get nicknames, and the same is true for this uh, SRPC 41K1, also known as the Baby Turtle. This watch has a design which is similar to the classic and standard size of the Seiko Turtle. The SRPC 41K1 is, as the name reveals, a Prospex watch. Prospex stands for Professional Specifications and simply means that the watch is built according to the needs and wants of professional divers. In other words, it is built to last. The SRPC 41K1, also known as Baby Turtle or Mini Turtle, this refers to the case design of this watch which derives from the Seiko Turtle because of, it, because of its shape is reminiscent of the turtle. The reason this is called Baby Turtle is that it is smaller than the standard turtle. And let's not forget that this watch is also a paddy. In case you are not familiar with paddy, it's the, it stands for Professional Association of Diving Instructors. This is a diving organization with which Seiko has a long history with. And obviously, what better partnership for a dive watch than with a diving organization with professional divers who will test and use the watch for what it is actually made of for. This watch features a turtle case. The backstory behind this watch is that in 2016, Seiko presented the first SRP777 Turtle, or in Japan, that's the SBDY015, which was a reissue of the Seiko Diver reference from the I think 70s, the 6309 and the 6306. It was a watch that was uh, very well received and which received a lot of praise. Although it has a size of 44 mm, which means it certainly isn't for everyone. And feedback was received from many people, people was that uh, while they enjoyed the design, it was too big. So Seiko made this RPC 41K1, of course, for those who cannot pull off the 44 millimeter size watches, but can actually enjoy the beauty and charm of the Seiko Turtles. With that said, the watch is presented with a stainless steel case with a diameter of 42.3, which is uh, a little bit smaller. The iconic cushion-shaped turtle design is still there, but the size of the case has been scaled down. The case has a thickness of 13 mm. On top of the case, it has a hard lex crystal. Of course, it has serious water resistance. This watch offers a water resistance of uh, 200 meters or 660 feet, which means it is uh, suitable for swimming, diving, and for practically any other type of water sports. To ensure its water resistance, it has a solid screw down case back and not a see through case back. It also has a crown, screw down crown, for added the uh, water resistance and unlike on the standard size turtle watches the crown is positioned at three o'clock which uh, actually comes as a surprise 
One of the reasons Seiko uses the 4 o'clock position of the crown is to improve the comfort when wearing the watch so it doesn't dig into the wrist. As for the dive watch, it is equipped with unidirectional bezel with a 60 minute ear graduation scale. Like all Paddy and Seiko collaboration watches, the bezel has a blue and red insert which is the signature colors of Paddy. The blue and red color combination, also known as uh, Pepsi to Seiko enthusiasts, is bright and appealing. This insert is uh, made in aluminum and has a slightly matte finish. The first 15 minutes are painted red, the rest is painted blue. And to help with the legibility, it has a luminous dot at 12 o'clock. The markers on the bezel are made in silver color. The watch is uh, presented with a blue silicone strap. And silicon always goes very well together with dive watches, both in terms of look, but also due to its water resistance properties. But uh, if you've been watching my channel, I usually don't use the strap or bracelet that comes with my watches. I usually kind of change it into something more my own. What stands out about the watch is that it uses softer lines that are not as aggressive as the turtle. Let's start out with the dial. The beautiful dial which is black and has a very intricate wave pattern which is stunning a stunning detail that makes it so much more vibrant. A black dial is more or less what you would expect in a dive watch as it ensures optimum contrast which is crucial with underwater. The dial has large hour markers which are applied. These markers are applied with Lumibright which are polylum this means uh, they will glow exceptionally long and bright. At 3 o'clock, it has a date window with a white background. Sitting on top of the crystal is a cyclops that helps enlarge the date and improve the legibility. It is also interesting to see that this one only has a date considering that the standard turtle has both the day and date windows. The watch has all of the Paddy's dial printing, which includes the Seiko logo, the Prospects logo, Paddy logo, and the automatic printed as well as the type rating. It uses the classic sword and arrow hands design and has a nice touch to match the bezel. The minute's hand has uh, been painted red and the hour hand is a bit shorter and has a satin metal finish. And the chapter ring which the uh, seconds are printed. We have uh, uh, 15 second increments in red mark. This watch is equipped with the Seiko Inosuka Automatic Caliber 4R35, which is an improvement from uh, the Seiko's most affordable automatic movement in H35, as it features both hacking seconds and manual winding functions. This movement offers a power reserve of 41 hours and beats with uh, 21,600 uh, beats per second. This movement has proven to be robust and reliable. And as a workhorse, it will continue to tick for years with little to no maintenance required. All in all, this uh, Seiko Prospects Mini Turtle is exceptional, especially for those who enjoy that uh, Seiko Turtle but uh, do not have that uh, big enough wrist to wear a bulky 44mm watch. This RPC 41K one is the answer to a lot of people's prayers. This watch offers everything we have come to expect from the Turtle watches. 
including great water resistance, solid build quality, and actually great value for money. As a nice touch, this particular watch is made in collaboration with Buddy and therefore has an appealing use of colors too. So thank you for watching. Please uh, don't forget to subscribe and click the like button below. Also, I have a, wa a watch giveaway. It's gonna be on the the link's gonna be on the description below.